a long time ago, when Disney Plus first came out, I got it. We all got it. I rem- it was like four or five dollars a month. We all got it. And what we ended up with is a kind of Disney vault. A, you know, new content with Marvel shows and, and Star Wars shows. It took a while, right? There was this like hiatus. Then we finally got Mandalorian after a few months of really having nothing new. Uh, we finally got Mandalorian. Mandalorian was great. And then there was that break again where a few months we had nothing. And in that break, I canceled um, Disney+. Plus. A lot of people d- canceled Disney+. Plus. I mean, their numbers were staggeringly uh, different during that hiatus after the Mandalorian. So then WandaVision comes back. We all get it back. And there's always been this kind of thing this uh, with Disney Plus. But in the last year or so, there was so many Marvel shows and, and Star Wars shows that there never felt like there was this downtime. And that's... That's why I'm canceled Disney Plus again, man. Like, I mean, I'm at the point where there's nothing new. Um, and then recently, you know, we have the announcements that that um, Echo and Loki are coming in like October and November. I mean, that's months away, man. I mean, if there's nothing else that's going to be on this app for me in, until October, I don't need it right now. I don't need to be paying an extra eight, nine, ten dollars a month um, for an app that isn't going to give me anything that I really want to watch for the next two or three months. Now, granted, my daughter really loves Disney Plus. She'll go through and watch all kinds of stuff on there, mainly Spidey and his amazing friends. But still, um, it has a lot of those kind of perks and they are putting those little weird movies up that they, they just look bad. You know, the, the, the kind of kids movies, you know, um, I can't even think of the most recent one that they put up, but they're just that bad that I don't want to remember them. I think, uh, but yeah, so it's, it's hard right now. Uh, and, and, you know, Mandalorian just ended. It was great. Very happy with, you know, the last, this most recent season, um, I believe it was four, three. Uh, I was, yeah, really happy with it. Enjoyed it a lot. But yeah, here I am finding myself paying for Disney Plus month after month again with no real new content that, you know, to, to attract me to want to stay and maintain my relationship with Disney Plus. So, you know. I would say if you're in the kind of same boat as me, don't be afraid to cancel for a couple months. It's okay. It's not like when you come back, they're like, hey, you know, it's more for you now. Huh? You know, it's nothing like that. You know, you could always come back. Same price is going to be the, it's going to be that same price two months from now. Um, it, yeah. I mean, like I said, low keys all the way in October. I could see myself not having this until then. You know, maybe they can pull me in with a what if season two here in the next month or two. But even then, I think I just get a buddy to come over and we log into his account for for this, you know, to the side being. <laughs> but yeah, that's are my thoughts. Uh, what are you guys' thoughts on Disney Plus right now and this kind of downtime? Is it downtime for you? Maybe you're loving the content that they're putting out right now. Maybe you're happy as can be. And, you know, if so, hats off to you. I'm, I'm glad that there are people out there that can enjoy it. Maybe you have a kid and you're just like, hey, it's from a kid, whatever. But definitely let me know your thoughts down in the comment section below. We want to take a second to thank one of the sponsors of the show, VFly. VFly is a company backed by Google and Google Ads. They use a trusted system to put your YouTube content in front of the right eyes, gaining your videos more views, likes, comments, and subscribers. And this is no BS bot stuff or fake views like all those other sites are going to give you. This company is backed by Google and has delivered on billions of views to date. I've been using VFly now for a while and I have just been stunned by the great results. Go visit VFly now with the link in the description and thank you to VFly for being a sponsor of the Screen Talk Live YouTube channel. 